my experience, I always had a little bit the uh, feeling that I was an advocate for the poor. And we are often working in very difficult governmental systems with a lot of corruption, with a lot of uh, difficult um, uh, um, uh, political and social situations. And I think we bring an added value to it. And uh, I think in a lot of countries, it's still necessary that we have this foreign support to bring the different stakeholders together to mediate the solution finding and this is our most important role. There are technical aspects inside, yes, but often in Africa you have good technicians but the technicians don't speak to the villagers and the villagers don't speak to the politicians and bring these different stakeholders together to do this process oriented solution finding, this is our main role. If I do a good job in development cooperation, I do it like that, that at the end I'm not needed any longer. I think the most important aspect in this sense is the national ownership. The uh, governments with whom we work together have to build up their own plans. For example, CADA process in Africa is really on uh, nearly all African level and in my opinion it's very important that the different development organizations are submitting in these plans. Women as a very important resource are not enough respected in our world. For example, uh, nutrition of small uh, kids depend a lot on women. Education of the kids depend a lot on women. And therefore, in my speech, I said gender is really an untapped potential and I, I put a lot of importance to, to gender. Yeah.